I've been able to stay awake for this part. What, Dredge in general? But my game is huge. Hold up. Let me fix this up real quick. Yes, sure. Yes, sure. What? There we go. Oh my god. I'm fully stored. What the fuck am I catch doing? Two rod spaces, yay! Huh. Nothing wrong with combining different engine types. Do anything you can to get more speed out of the space you have. Oh, wait, I forgot. I was trying to get more engine space. I guess I have space for another rod. Do I need it? Check the tree. Oh, I could get this one. Not really worth, though. This is a six slaughter? Oh no, it's not literally six. So it fits here. And then I could toss in the... This one, like, right above. Yeah, I can fish everything already. <laughs> the other one is just, like, increased efficiency, is all. Alright, well... Most recent thing I did was I. Oh my god, I almost crashed. I went to the station right here and I turned in two fish because that's what it requested. So I gotta go check out what these other ones need. I could just grab stuff anyway. Oh my god! Can I only see him at night? No. A ruby ring, baby. Let's fucking go. Ruby earrings! Bro, it's actually kind of hard to navigate these waters. Hey, he's right here. That's the fish I need. Wait. No, it's not. What the? I fucking lied. Maybe I can check the encyclopedia. That looks like it. Devil spine, night or day rod. All right. I'm gonna fart. Oh! I just shit myself.
it's not a ghost shark that I need. Right? I mean, I'll just pick the shit up, I guess. Uh-oh. Do they only really disturb me at night? Are the piranhas the lava piranhas? The fucking devil. Place your hand on the stone. A deep vision enters my mind. Blackness, a crimson rift opens in the void. Dreadful silhouettes drift through in a procession of teeth and tentacles. After the last grotesque figure emerges, a membrane spreads over the fissure. A distant groan emanates from the space beyond. Jesus fuck. Get off me, pussy. This doesn't look very good. Let's go sell. Oh my god. Bro, what the fuck? When was that thing there? Oh my god. Mm. My money. Mm. No. Not that fish market. Mm. So my crab pots, right? Yeah. Spider crab. Hundred bucks for spider crabs? Yo. Take it. See you, Zivante. Well, I should sleep, actually. I need the eyeball to go down. Is this it? No. Armored Cerebin. Cerebin. Was it the ghost shark? Did I have it? Really? You think it was? Yeah? We'll look for some more ghost sharks. 
your friends want you to play Lost Ark with them, but you're hesitant because of the hoding grind. Uh, I mean, it's a fun-ass game. The raids are hella good. I think you can look past the percent chance of failing. I mean, like, if you play enough, it doesn't really factor. Like, if you have enough materials and have enough gold, like, it doesn't even matter if you fail. Because you're gonna fail. Time, what the fuck? Guess I gotta throw away the rare one, whatever. Okay. Ow. Ow. I lost my fish! This out of the menu, Mr. Minu. I have to edge it. Store. Okay. I do have space. Wait, do I even need the refined metal anymore? like I don't mm. all right how much 450 I'm gonna just farm for it real quick Should take just a little bit can I get two things Oh yeah, like I could put this big one right here, and I could put the hook right here, and I could put this one right here. I should sleep. I'm setting an alarm for 11.59. I need to go see if my auto cat feeder works.
story missions you have to do? What, this game? Yeah. Oh, I didn't sleep. Oops. Oh my god, my game just froze. You think they're gonna camp it? Go and show you? Yeah, probably. Ghost shock. We are farming some money, boys. Farming some money. Some upgrades to the ship. Dude, SMT5 is such a good game, and that's why I'm... Saving it for last. It'll be the final game I ever beat. SMT5. I'm getting buried in my fucking grave. I'm in the coffin. I loaded up on the switch. Say, the time has come. I do what I must. The game crashes. I lose all my save progress because I'm on a fucking switch. And then I die in peace. Oh my god, get these things off of me. <gasps> wow. That was fucked up. Wait, I'm dead. Hey, <laughs> not dead. Man, that was fucked up, actually. I mean, I, I wasn't sure how the interaction worked with, like, the go away button. Because every time I pushed it, it felt like it made him go, like, off screen and stuff. The big fish. Uh, I don't lose everything. I just lose whatever gets knocked out of the ship. Wow, these don't sell for much? Or are they all stale? What the? Yeah, maybe because I slept. Five hundred buckaroonish. Cash for gold. Sell a total of fifteen hundred dollars worth of trinkets.
think I can get one of the engines now. fit like right there. No time to linger. I have a combined total engine speed of 75. All right, I wanted to buy this one too. 270. Crimson King, welcome back. I'm actually zooming. It did work, Mr. Risk PvP. We have the technology. Alright, yo. Plus 26.3. Alright, we're fast as fuck. Oh my god, we're so fast. Actually, I should get some more fish real quick. In case I need repairs. Three-headed cod. No! That was the first time I've whiffed that, actually. Fuck. He long. Oh, he long as fuck, boy.
wonder if I'll get stuff for turning in the, uh, the flames. This looks new. Rat tail. read rat tail real quick found of the great depths these are the most abundant of all deep sea fish they gather in large numbers or on structures in the deep huh. it's a real fish The most abundant fish. Oh, my crabs. Oh, we got hella crabs. What? Ooh. Volcano snail. The fuck? I mean, don't think things kind of fit perfectly. Whatever. What does the volcano snail say? This hefty beast lives around hydrothermal vents. Its foot is coated in hundreds of iron plates, which means you could catch this snail with a magnet. Real fish, Pog, you. Get a better light, I think. A lot of money. Light at the night achievement. Have a combined light strength of 3,000 lumens. first so it's not too dark let's go turn in one of the flames hopefully I can access storage here Statues left, middle. Okay, I need to go straight, straight bussin' bussin'. I'll break one of these. Fuck it.
What do we need? Oh. It's actually what it is? Okay, it is. So I need two monster fish. I know how to locate them. Hey, a message in the bottle. First of June. Yesterday was the reading of his mother's will. Most of the remaining estate went directly to him, of course. But to my surprise, she bequeathed him her, me her pocket watch. Curious. I'm not fond of the thing, but I know what a, that taking it will mean a lot to him. I can't help but feel some veiled jab at me from beyond the grave. She was the type to do this sort of thing. Was I late on some occasion? I can't recall. Grilled fucking shark. I mean, I could just fish. Oh, wait, you know what? Using this actually has seemingly guaranteed corruption. Yeah. Wait, this thing's infected. It's not normal. Not quite what I was expecting. Maybe... I can try turning it in? See what it says? Oh my god, I assumed I won. No! A sickly stench arises from your cargo. Okay, so if you have something infected, it chains to other ones. I didn't know that. I mean, it didn't take it, so... I doubt it works. Think I'll survive this? Something slithers into your cargo hold. What? Hmm. Oh my god, they're infected again. It's fine. It was me, Smile, and I'm in your boat. Oh. Well, that's not good. Hey, he's right there. Big guy. You're cringe, you're cringe, you're cringe.
Get the fuck off of me! Fuck it. There we go. Alright, I got one. Could turn it in before it's too late. Oh, nice. What the hell? Yo, that boy kind of big. Oh, I think he can't even do anything, huh? I think the boy doesn't even see me. Oh, wait, my food's gonna pop out, I think, for the cats in two minutes. The fanatic awaits. Stone tablet surrounded by tooth and bone. A glyph of the hook is carved into the center. All right, let me be back. <laughs> yeah. I got it to work. Siggy lost at fucking sea, boys. Spam pot friend. Now, everybody go. Pot friend, pot friend, pot friend. <clears throat> what is it? The flames are lit. I can feel it. The chill of the deep touches us now. It is time. Come, you fall into the footsteps of the temple. At the top is a black stone altar. Stacked high upon the altar are layers of dark, damp wood. <clears throat> he pulls an antique pocket watch from inside his robe. Droplets of sea spray crackle and seethe. <laughs> you are drawn to it, I see. It found me during my ride of proving as I scavenged for creatures of power. It sat to my spirit when I first recovered it, but I came to appreciate its strange nourishment with time. It is almost yours. May it mark the start of your journey in the end. He begins to chant. Say nothing. The wind picks up. Sea, swirling sea, spray around the altar. A cold blue flame rises from the sodden wood. Say nothing. The freezing blaze climbs his legs. His chanting continues, no pain detectable in his voice. He lifts his arms skyward. Seconds later, the inferno engulfs him. Oh. It rages for a moment, then abruptly dies away. <laughs> Old mist pools around the floor of the temple, brief before the wind sweeps into the sea. Holy shit, he fucking died. Inspect the pyre. Oh god. That's gonna be me, isn't it? Jesus fuck. The first Elden Flame Ring. That guy's not summoning Satan. The next guy's summoning Satan. You ready? Well, I should probably pick this up. Eh, and come back. This guy's the Satan guy. You climb the broken steps, deliver the relic. He approaches, drawing closer with an incessant ticking. You have the pocket watch. You take out the watch. Its once frozen hands are now inexplicably twitching in a rhythmic struggle. 
trying but failing to move forward. You place it in front of the collector. Though it has been some decades since I last laid eyes upon this, the sound of its mechanisms has grown no less unpleasant. And with that, our collection is complete. I must admit, I am surprised. I do not think you had the determination for such a job. I got an achievement. Give up the pocket watch. Now, with these five relics in our possession, one thing remains. I suspect you know by now. Know what? It will become apparent soon enough. We must make one final voyage. This time, I will be with you. Okay. You're entering the final phase of the game. Your progress will not be saved. You wish to continue? Okay. The relics are coming with us. We should wait for the fog to thicken. With luck, the seeds will remain unaware of our intentions. Our destination is in the open expanse to the west of the Great Marrow. Marked on the map. We must not tarry on the open waters. Not with such a significant cargo. Make haste. Where is he? Ah! Fuck! We gotta go, we gotta go! I'm so fast, man. This is the place. This is where she was taken from us. And where we can at last bring her back. Only here. Only because what we've achieved. He opens the book and begins to read aloud. To release the lost one. Frozen in time. He throws the pocket watch overboard. And tethered by change in the deep. He throws the necklace. Bind them to this world once more. He throws the ring. Open the door to the starry heavens. He slots the key into the lock of the music box. And lay the weary world to rest. He throws the music box overboard. Its key left unturned. Uh-oh. Oh, it's a girl. Look, it's not Satan. Oh. Uh -uh. I think that might be Satan, though. What the fuck? Oh, my God. What is that? <laughs> Uh... <laughs> Was that Cthulhu? <laughs> oh shit, we beat the game. Oh, it looks like we killed the whole town. That's a lot of playtesters. That was pretty cool. That was probably the bad ending. Considering I... summoned fucking Satan. Oh, sorry, Cthulhu. Yes, I summoned Cthulhu. Nice, Silo. You just missed the ending, bro. No, thanks for your sub.
This is a story game. Where I played a fish mini game sometimes. Alright, let's get the credits. Next! Wait, you said... If I took the book, there's another ending? How do you take the book? Are you human? He gives me a piercing gaze. Why, well, of course, as human as you are. The words are from that book. What'd they do to me? The book holds power from the deep. I merely extend its powers towards you. Atrophy. This face instantly culls the closest shoal of fish, readying them for swift reaping. It can be heard from a great distance, so you need to not be close to your victims. But the population is unlikely to recover from such a vile trauma, using it sparingly. I have to keep denying him the last trinket? You mean like this? find the old mayor northeast where like here camp in devil spine this is just two endings one good one bad Yeah, okay. Cringe. I just lost my engine to that. Now I'm fucking slow. Did I try the limits of the ocean? No. Cruel heat achievement. Keep your haste. Burn meter book 50% for 10 seconds. Nice. Oops. Did I not go here at all? I guess not. It's literally a lit campfire here. You unlock next to an old rowboat. Somebody's here. He's hunched over by the campfire, muttering to himself. You cautiously approach. Visit every dock in the game achievement unlocked. Did you... Did you throw it back? Huh? The book! I don't understand. I'm not seeing things. It's really you, isn't it? Who do you think I am? He turns away, wringing his hands. He speaks to the fire. It was him. Him and his damned wife. They dredged up that old book. But something, something cloaked in fog followed it out. Right through the boat. Boom. The man makes crude explosion noises and motions with his hands, still talking to the fire as though pantomiming a story to a child. It spoke and said it was coming for our breath. They wouldn't be needing it soon and then darkness crashed down. An age later some of us washed up on the shore and him still clutching that book. Throw it back! We cried as the fog rolled ashore. We thought surely it could still be undone. What book? Silver and Crimson. The book covered in her blood. Not making any sense. Throw it back! 
He closes his eyes tight as he holds back tears. His voice falls a whisper. Please, the lighthouse keeper. She saw. She knows where it came from. Where is it? Where it needs to go. You actually change your name again on Twitch? Joyous Remnants? <sighs> what do you know about the Silver and Crimson book? She shudders at the very mention of the book. You're really asking me after all this time? You know it must be your turn. She looks at you with deep pity. You have to move on for her sake as well as yours. Take control. Be rid of that thing once and for all. What do you about the old mayor? That uh, he's... I try not to think about him. It's a painful memory for us all. Some day I still think I can hear the hums of his engine sailing past the bay, but I know he's gone. I don't want to talk about it anymore. Oh, what the hell? Now I talk to the collector. Okay, we're back. Hey, we're at that book of yours. Which book? This one here? With a wry grin, he pulls a dusty tome from the near shelf and glances at the cover. There's not much to it to be said of histories of the Grey Isles. It's quite a chore. Don't play dumb, you know which book I mean. Play dumb, your Bakashi's wearing me. I suppose we must go through this rigmarole once again. The Book of the Deep appears in his hand, sheathed in its dirty crimson jacket. Go ahead, ask us. Where'd you get it? Sparkling dust motes hang in the air between you. Don't you remember? You were there. The air around the book begins to pulse rhythmically like a quickening heartbeat. So was she. Who? I wonder forget begged me. The broom bristles. This is what you asked for. Give me the book. The words hang in the space between. You won't change a thing. The book is ours. Step closer. You take a step closer through the crackling room. The collector lurches forwards in response. What could you possibly hope to achieve? Take the book. You strike out with your right fist, punching hard to the jaw of the collector. His face shatters and falls to the ground. Huh? You're pathetic. What? He's just a fucking mirror? Understand this plainly. Before you sink us into despair, I know how you how to bring her back. It's all right there on the pages, and now you've seen its power firsthand. We wield the power to release her from her slumber. Find her last relic and we can undo everything. Undo what you did. What I did? What the? Huh? Where do I go now? Light keeper, maybe? Wait. Yeah, that's kind of crazy, actually. I have the book. You've had it this whole time, have you not? It doesn't matter. I'll make the most of this window of lucidity. Now's the time to act. You still remember where it happened? Isn't in that gloomy darkness behind the bay? When you're ready, I'll point the way. You must wait until night is thickest, until the ocean says it was, all those years ago. Why would you be going the Kraken area? Follow my light. Do do what's right for her. Throw it back. You talking about this? Stellar Basin? You can disable it. Just do the quest. I'm going to the Kraken spot. I mean the... Cthulhu.
What? What did I get hit by? I lost a fucking engine? This is the place. Throw it back. The book struggles in your grasp, its weight somehow shifting from side to side. Silver ribbons flail pathetically against your fingers. Throw it back. You hold it high above your head. A low groan rumbles from the book, echoed by another from the depths. Throw it back. You throw it into the foaming water. Oh my god. Am I gonna get eaten? <laughs> the good ending. I kill myself. Bro, wait, that's actually deep as fuck, isn't it? Like... I'm the collector? I smash a mirror? I fucking lose my mind? He didn't have to fit into my boat when I was moving the collector because I'm the collector? There's one other part of it, too. Yeah, the town survived. I end the world, but I get my wife back. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah, that's really cool. I mean, there's post-game in... You know... Just complete the Fishopedia. There's some shit I haven't seen. Gotcha, big boy. Let me see what happens if I try to go, like, out here. What even happens if I go, like... ...too high in the insanity meter? There's an old man with 43 skill points waiting for me? <gasps> what the hell? I can turn with my mouse? Oops. I just fucking heated my engine to hell. Will I make it off map? I feel like I just go insane or something. It's my light. 
There we go. Is it infinite? I'm not really moving anywhere on the map. It's that thing. Look back, I can see the islands going further. Entering uncharted waters, turn back. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh. Oh. Oh, shit. That guy's kind of big. Wait, it's so bright out here. I'm so slow. You think that thing's real too? Oh. <laughs> Holy shit. Nice. Pog, GG. Go game. Every time you die, you get the good ending, maybe? Hmm. Potentially. I mean, the game was pretty short. But pretty good. It didn't really have, like, pacing issues. I have nine hours played on it. And I beat it. I did, like... I did a lot of the side quest stuff. I mean, it was it was like main story mainly. But like I had to do like side stories to do that. 23. You know, like the the main story was collecting the stuff for the collector. Parentheses me collecting things for myself. Yo, Ziggy the Great. Welcome back. That was the main story, but, like, it made you do other stuff along the way. I'm still missing, like, it was a little less than half of the fish. The total fish in the game. It didn't even seem like it would be, like, tedious to get them all. It might be tedious to get every variation of the fish, though. Like, if you try and get a rare and a corrupted version. You probably don't need the rare version, though. The trophy or whatever you want to call it.